So, as I promised, testing it. Okay. This thing is moving. So, it shouldn't be... Everything is connected. The battery, solar cells, everything. This thing is moving. I have motor inside, so the battery shouldn't be touching it. Otherwise, it's not gonna be good. This is really not a good idea, but I had to try it. Maybe I should try it without even, without the... Oh, I know. I know. What the heck? You know what? It's supposed to go nose up. Forget it. It's gonna be easier like that. Even less aerodynamic. So if it flies, flies. If it doesn't, doesn't. My assumption, because the model is very heavy. 1.6, it's not very, but it's heavy. It's balanced nicely. Yeah. It's 1.5 kilos, but uh, 20, 21, 20 something watt, it's just not enough for model this weight to keep the sustained flight. Wind is blowing. Is it, is it changing direction now? No, go from here. Yeah. Wish me luck. See? Just not enough fuel. Not enough power. Maybe I should leave it charged like this for about five hours. <laughs> then it's going to be working fine, I guess. Let's see one more time. Maybe I should throw it higher. It is quite windy now. Wind is picking up. I'm just afraid not to hit it in that. Uh, in that fence, that's gonna be not good. You okay? Rolling? Time remaining, nine Come on, come on, come on, no. Whoa, man, it's gonna be a long run. Must be at least 300 meters that way. So you can record me jumping a little, but it's, it's okay. Like, there is no way you can throw it with your hand that far. So it, it does have some power, but it's really fighting to keep it level. As soon as you go left and right, of course, you have to compensate. And then, uh, then it's just on the edge of sustaining flight.
least a good thing when you're retrieving your model if you have a nice sun on the way back you, you can recharge it <laughs> that's amazing all contacts are there everything's okay stronger wind now Maybe I should charge it a little bit more. Wind is not good. I'm afraid when I turn toward me, because right now it's nice because it's gonna be flying this way, so it's gonna be charging angle is gonna be even better. Instead of this, it's gonna be more direct. But as soon as you tip to the one wing, this is gonna be ideally, so you should be flying right. But I'm afraid of putting it in that wet area and it's gonna be end of it and wind is just blowing from that area so let's try one more time and mosquitoes of course are killing me Just enough, not just not enough power. Just not enough power. Because if I if I go any slower, it's gonna stall. It started to stall. You need more speed. With more speed you get more speed, but the angle of attack is not enough and you just go, you hit the ground faster. It's just too heavy for this setup. Or I should charge it for maybe, as I said, one or two hours or at home and then fly. I'm gonna start one more time, but that without battery. With the batteries as a weight, but just directly on sunlight. It's gonna be the same thing, but I'm gonna try. Just wanna try. Okay, two leads. Red plus, minus, black. Disconnected. Now it's pure solar. The batteries are disconnected. That's just for maintaining a center of gravity. I'm gonna tuck it in. Tuck it this one, not short circuit, hopefully. And that's it. Now we're gonna try to fly it. Time expired. Time cleared. Another 10 minutes. Just pure electric solar, I wanted to say. Let's see. Ah, oh, that doesn't have power. I don't think so. See? Ideally, you should be flying like this. Actually, like this. But not toward the ground. Down. A little bit up, but doesn't have enough power. No way. Just not enough power for this weight. You should probably keep it like a 400, 500 grams. And with this wind, then, then it's gonna be hard to control anyway. For 10 minutes and then start again. Leave it plugged in for 10 minutes and then start again. Oh. 
Okay, we gave it about 10 minutes in slightly inclined position. See? About 10 minutes charging time. Now we're gonna check it. Now we're gonna try again. Still charging. But I think 10 minutes. Of course, if you charge it more, it's gonna be more power and everything, but I just wanna give it a try for 10 minutes. I didn't touch any controls. Let's see, is it gonna be any better? Any more luck? See, it's very, very heavy, and it's not, I know, it's not very aerodynamic, too. But it's a testing, right? Nice pose for the nice picture. Right here. Salaruhu. Made in Germany. They don't make it anymore. <laughs> Good. Okay, one more try. Check control. Whoa! No way. I ruined it because I put it up. It's down. I put it up, and that's why I stole it. Well, it is what it is. Too much and too little. Too much weight, too little power. So, thank you for watching. It sucks, I know. That's life. <laughs> thank you for watching. So, nothing was broken, broken. Just this one. There is a plastic. Plastic guy, which holds the whole thing. That's kind of uh, broken, but it's a plastic. So we had to do uh, this one first in order to slide the wing. That that guy is broken, but it's nothing. So just put the new new plastic thing. This guy here, three millimeter, or any size you want. You can look inside how it looks. That's receiver here, just the two channel radio. Antenna, I just put antenna out because of the reception, better reception. I made it uh, 2015. That's uh, pretty hollow. This is a balsa model. First. This is heavy, I cut it out of the, this is the problem, the main reason, because it's not just the solar cells, which are, by the way, dusty still. That's the thick plastic. I cut it out of the out of the big solar panel. So it's easy fix. It's basically nothing. Really nothing. You put it back, put this one back. Oh I see a small crack here too. Both sides. Because this plastic is really thin and it's very heavy. So it's it's really nothing. You just put a little bit of glue inside. This thing is still working, so basically everything is intact. If I go with a with a lithium batteries, we're just trying to reduce the weight of these guys. Just put the pure solar, clean solar cells without the plastic protection. They would be not so strong like this one, but then uh, it would be much lighter. Some people put the solar cells inside the ribs, ribs and they just uh, and plus these cables are kind of too thick I think everything is extra weight so no wonder it doesn't fly good well it's good thank you for watching and have a nice day bye bye Oops.